Welcome to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today we get to start the second part in our little Pokemon journey story arc thing that I'm, you know, wanting to do. Anyway, we get, get to jump into Soul Silver here today. Right a hot on the heels of that terrible Elite Four I put together. Because, yeah, that was, that was bad. That was bad. Mostly my fault, but that was still bad. Um, but anyway. So, let's, let's get into this. I'm excited to play this. I really am. Um, I think this is going to be a lot of fun. It's going to be long, but it's going to be a lot of fun. This first episode um, is probably going to be pretty long, actually. It's probably going to get close to 30 minutes. Um, what I plan on doing is getting all the way up to Mr. Pokemon's and back. You know, with, with our new, uh, with our with our wonderful starter and all that good shit. Anyway. Um, so yeah, that's, that's pretty much where we are. Um... In terms of, yeah, well, you know we're gonna be a boy. You know we're gonna be a boy. You know it. You know it. I mean, and, and you know, and you know what our name is here. We are gray. Cause that's just fucking who we are. And, and all that good shit. Oh, what the hell happened? I have some. Uh, I don't have some. Well, yeah, some friends of mine that that always argue with me about you know picking girl characters because they get pissed off that I always choose guy characters. And, and I think it's kind of lame that they always pick girls because, you know, apparently they attribute gender and sex to uh, a fucking pixel, which I think is absolutely ludicrous. I mean, I, I've heard people you actually argue that, oh, I don't want to look at boy ass all day. It's like, wow. Really? Jesus. Just, like, really? I can't believe people try, actually try and swing that shit. But anyway, you know, we're here. And we're doing all this shit. With our wonderful little creepy mom here. Oh, yeah. You're the fucking cheap ass mom that steals my money. You little bitch. That's who she is. She's a fucking bitch. Because she's just going to be like, oh, you've got money. I'm going to take it and put it in the thing and buy you shit with your own money. Because I think you should have this shit. But anyway, we don't like her. We don't like her at all. Mm -mm. Not one bit. I didn't even. I didn't even save. Anyway, all right. But anyway, oh look at you, little fucking Meryl thing and all that stuff. And Lyra and this chick, I, I don't really care for all that much and all that good shit. She's over here. Yep, hoppy, 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 motherfucker. All right. Let's get on. Let's let's get on over here. So you just jump right into this shit and be like, yo, 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 yo. All right. Um, as far as starter, um, I think I know who I'm gonna go with. Um, but you know, and, and I'll explain to you here in a second uh, why why this is. Man, does this guy fucking talk forever or what? Holy shit! God damn! Oh yeah, and his little his little fucking email. Did you hear it ring? It rings. His email rings when he gets an email. How, how fucking how fucking techy is that shit? Little bastard! Come on, come on, come on, come on! Yeah, we count on him. No, you can't count on me because I'm gonna steal your shit, son. You just don't know. You just don't know. Normally, I would go with Chikorita. Um, honestly, I like grass types. You know that. You should know that. Total Dial, I was really on the fence about choosing. Um, for this purpose and this purpose alone, I have not used Total Dial that much. And it would have been a nice to start with a water type instead of plant type last time. But, we are going to choose Cyndaquil. Now I know, now I know a lot of people out there like fire types and Cyndaquil and stuff is pretty popular. It's, I've never used it, so that's why I'm gonna choose it. I've never used this Pokemon. I have no idea what its move set is. I mean, I'm I'm brand new to this thing. Seriously, um, I I have one in my like my starters breeder pile thing that I got on Gen Six, but I don't. I've never used one. Um, so yeah, that's that's why we're gonna pick one up here today. Um, and oh oh oh. And also, one of the reasons why I decided not to go with Totodile and with who is now going to be called Pele. 
I know it's a feminine name, but it's gonna work, all right? Um, the reason why I didn't choose Totodile is because I did promise or, you know, say that I was gonna go get Lapras in this LB, which I do plan on doing. Um, also, there's other water types that I kind of thought about using for the group as well. But, you know, we'll just go with Cyndaquil, like I said, and um, just shoot for Lapras just because we can go with Lapras. Lapras is awesome. I mean, who doesn't like Lapras? I mean, come on. You know what's fucked up, though, is the emulator that I'm using is not recognizing the X and the Y buttons. I had this problem earlier when I was kind of setting up the shit, and I was hoping that when I went and changed it, it would actually save it. And this is going to be kind of a pain in the ass if I've actually got to go in there and dictate to it that... I mean, well, actually, let me take that back. I know what... Because, see, here, it, it ties X and Y to the other things, which... I just remember that it's start and, and, and whatever the hell it is, select on this control. I don't know why it defaults to that. But like I said, I changed it before, so it was actually X and Y and all that good shit. But it didn't want to fucking, it didn't want to fucking see it. So anyway, here we are. Oh my god, Lyra, Lyra, Lyra. Right here in fucking New Shit Town, I mean New Bark Town. I figured we go with the the orangish brown or whatever the hell that is. I mean, it's kind of kind of like this tinge of fucking I don't know whatever the hell it is shit color brown to me. But um, I figured we go with that just because it's we got ourselves an orange Pokemon and, and it's got fire and shit on it. All right, give me give me my thing. Yep, mm -hmm, give me my thing. Give me, give me my Poke Queer. I mean my Poke Gear. So we can get on, get on out of here, get on, getting on, and all that shit. Um, hopefully, uh, hopefully the the audio is is okay because um, I for whatever reason everything sounded really really loud. Instead of that, or I was yelling at the top of my fucking lungs when I was recording, you know, or dicking around with stuff. So my my rig has kind of stayed the same, but I've kind of had to mess with the audio a little bit so that. I'm not quite, I'm trying not to be super loud or anything right now, which is unfortunate because when I was doing this earlier, it was, I was excited and I wanted to get all excited and shit for this, but I guess I'm going to have to fucking, fucking reel myself in here and, and, and be kind of fucking monotone and shit. But anyway, here we are. Good old Route 29. And we don't have running shoes yet. We got those from this creepy, cracked out old guy up here. So, um, yeah, that's about it. Um, so let's let's sit and reflect a little bit on our Elite Four experience, which by now was probably like yesterday that this went up, that the Elite Four went up. And um, yeah, so so yeah, let's let's reflect upon that, how terrible, terrible that was. That was mostly my fault. I'm not gonna lie. I I probably should have looked ahead to see what kind of um. Uh, what kind of, uh, I don't know, what kind of fucking, uh, you know, what kind of levels of Pokemon they had, because I didn't. And, you know, so that kind of was a level 63 Dragonite was a bit out there for me. Um, and I didn't buy enough, I didn't buy enough heals, obviously. Um, that's, that's why I kind of did the things I did instead of just pumping them full of, you know, potions and shit. I tried to make it go as far as I possibly could. And, and in the end, it got messy and goddamn ugly and all that good shit. We go up here, right? I want to say we do fucking Centret. It's Centret. I do have um, kind of an idea of what Pokemon I want to get, but we'll we'll see when we get there. But um, yeah, back to Elite Four. That was just that was just a mess. And I apologize. But then again, I guess that's what people tune in for is to see me just fuck that shit up and struggle. And that's kind of why I stopped at level 50. I could have gone up to like level 55. Um, but I decided, you know, I was like, ah, fuck it, you know, we're here, we're close enough, it's gonna be tough. And like I said, with heals, being able to, like, just heal spam through a f couple of those fights and stuff like that, you know, like the Dragonite, you know, with, um, whatever the hell it was and all that good shit, with, um, like, Leech Seed on it or whatever, I think it would have Leech Seed, yeah. You know, like, like that, you know, probably would have been best instead of trying to risk it, you know, and have to try and get a move in and have him just still Oko something. But, you know, that's just the way it is. Um, lesson learned, I guess, right? But, like I said, I mean, it's people don't really tune in to watch you, you know, 
kick ass and take names, honestly. I mean, especially in Pokemon. I mean, that's why, that's why I watch fucking LPers and shit, is because I want to see them get their asses kicked. I want to see, I want to see them struggling. I want to see them, you know, figure out a way to survive. And like I said, it wasn't pretty, and I didn't feel, I didn't feel accomplished or anything when I was done with the Elite Four in the last one. It was kind of just one of those things where it's like, yeah, fucking, thank God it's over with. You know what I mean? It was just such a fucking, I don't know. It, it, I was a little more irritated at the end of it than I should have been, I think. But I didn't really feel like I had done anything right. I felt like the whole time I was just all over the place, you know, in terms of moves. And I know I fucked up on a couple of them, like making fucking Pidgeotto fly for no damn reason. I accidentally just misclicked that. I got all excited and clicked the wrong move. No, but shit like that, you know. But, um, anyway. Oh, dink. Says, oh, well, yeah, creepy old guy. But, um, you know, like I said, I, I felt like I was kind of just all over the place. Didn't really have much of a strategy. Also, yeah, I also have to remember we didn't have really anything in terms of items or anything to help us level and shit. That's the cat jingling when she walks away. She's all fucking like, oh, I want to shake my head and make all sorts of jingly noise and shit while Gray's recording, because I'm a dick. Just like everyone else who decides to fucking call me when I sit down and record. I'm sorry, guys, it's ridiculous. But anyhow, um, this is where we're at. We're not going to get a Pidgey this time. In case you haven't gotten that, we might get our asses kicked here. Come on, that damn. Oh, Jesus, don't, oh, don't crit, don't crit, don't crit. Oh, Jesus. Well, I guess we have to use some of the potions that, um, what's his nuts gave us there. But, anyway, I mean, I guess, like I said, I guess this is, you know, some practice, because, you know, I usually play Pokemon, but I don't really play it with any sort of mindset, like, you know, it's a Nuzlocke or anything like that. Sure, I try not to let things die and stuff like that, but generally I'm kind of just, you know, out there and wheeling the deal and just fucking winging it. I don't like a shit. Because that sounds right. Fucking smokescreen. He learned smokescreen at level 6. I am going to fight a few things here on the way. I mean, I should be running just for the hell of it. But look at that. We got our potion back. But, um... You know, we kind of need to get get a little bit of levels under our belt. I kind of want to be, like, level 7 by the time we fight. You know, sitting your cock ass. Which, I don't know if you noticed him, but he was sitting by the thing. Looking in the fucking building spying on us through the fucking window while we were picking our Pokemon. Yeah, he's a little bastard like that. But anyhow, here we are doing this shit. This fucking app, of course. Like, I wonder what that, what the fucking meaning was like when, when they decided on that name. I mean, what were they like? Oh, God. Let's make a, you know, we, we want to combine a fruit and, and, a, and a fucking vegetable and, and, you know, call it something. Oh, what should we call it? I don't know. Those, those, those things where we put the Pokeball and you know, they get the fruit from the poker tree and make the pokeball shit. Yeah, fuck it, let's do that. Let's let's just fucking, you know, name it. What are we gonna name it? I don't know. Fucking apricots? No. Corn? No. Apricorn. Fucking sold. No, I mean, that. what was that meaning like? <laughs> I mean, if it was like that, then goddamn, I guess I could work for Game Freak because I can make up all sorts of fucking shit. Waterkini. There we go. Watermelon zucchini. Yeah. No? You don't like that one? No. Well, that, that's just too bad. I got other ones full floating around in my head, but I'll, I'll fucking dig them out later and just fucking spout them randomly. Maybe that should be a Pokemon name. Fucking Water Zucchini. Water Kini. That's, that, sounds, that sounds appropriate. But anyway. I mean, seriously, what, like, I don't know. What do people think when they make that sort of shit up? Apricorns? I mean, come on now. It's just fucking weird. That's just me. And oh yeah, Mr. Poke Douche's house. Oh, oh holy crap, he came running over here fast. Why can't we run that fast? Inside. Think about that. Now we got a little fucking pet togepi that no one wants to fucking use. Oh that good shit. Oh yeah, a friend of mine, an ecrutique and all that shit and blah blah blah. I'm thinking maybe an Eevee later. Is that is that something good? I don't know what I'm gonna use it. I haven't used an Eevee yet. But maybe we could pick up like an Evolution or something. I mean if we didn't have if we didn't wow, for a second I thought he said, So you're gay! 
and he said, so you're gray. I, that's probably what a lot of people will be fucking seeing, you know, because of the name, but yeah, you know, all that good shit. But anyhow, and fucking Professor Oak here is hitting on our mom. I know what this fucker's all about. He's fucking hitting on our mom all throughout the last fucking game, little dick. Um, oh, um, uh, we can also potentially do if people really want me to voice their opinions, you know, comments or shit like that. Um, we could also go and, um, uh, do red if we really want to. Now, it'll be a pain in the ass because if I remember right, I think he's like 80, things are like 85s, 88s or some shit like that. I think, I think he does. You know, and, and I think... I think the Elite Four stops at like 70, 75 or something. I want to say. So we'd have to do a shit ton of leveling um, to get that far. But, but we could do it. We could do it. Oh, do I want to go over there? Yeah, fuck it. We're just going to do it. Because we haven't fought anything, and yeah. Um,. But we could do it. It takes some. It takes some uh, grinding and all that good shit. Um, but we. I think we could do it. I, I think we'd have some fun. Um, with that, it'd be like it'd probably be like a while after like the last episode aired, or a while after the final finale, I guess. You know, final time, final bout with the Elite Four. Probably be a little after that. Just because you know we have to do some significant leveling, I think, and yeah, that would that would suck. Quite honestly, it'd take take quite a while. And if I remember right, I think we get the I think we get the XP share really late in this game. If I remember right, I think. But anyway, should be all right. Um, but yeah, yeah. Fuck you, you little red-haired bastard. Yeah, Pele. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. I don't even know if he's like special attack or physical attack. I don't remember. <laughs> I mean, this is completely. I when when this game came out, the original originally, I I was so disinterested in the starters. I really was. I was like, yeah, Chikori is kind of cute, but I I I. Took it just because you know it's it's grass and, and that's kind of where my loyalties lie and all that good shit. And then <laughs> and then it was just like fuck it, I don't know what else to use. But oh fuck, oh wrong way. Anyway, yeah, fucking Pele here. Um, what we can do though later. Oh god, nope, damn it, shit. Damn. Anyway, um. Yeah, I don't even know what I was gonna say. Oh, yeah, I, I really hope that um, you know, and while I was talking about fucking dickheads, red hair over there, really hope that they don't take that out. I haven't seen too much, and I haven't really. I mean, I don't have my finger on the pulse of you know fucking Omega Ruby news and all that shit, so I really don't know. I really hope they didn't take out the customization in that in oh, away from Pokemon now like they added it in Gen 6 with the hair and, and this fucking uh, clothes and stuff just because you know I kind of I kind of like that shit uh, you know I mean if you've watched my other videos you know that I like customization and I like you know making the game your own kind of experience and um, and all that good shit so you know I'm, I'd be really disappointed if they actually took that out because all of the shit that they're showing obviously is just with the normal kid with this little fucking beanie thing spiky beanie whatever the hell that is because apparently it's a hat not hair which why can't we have not hats on have you noticed that it's like it's it's like oh what are we gonna name this guy what are we gonna name this guy hmm this name fucking dick, cause he's a dick. This kid's a prick. I don't like him at all. I'm like any other rivals, except fucking what's her name, Sabrina or Serena? Serena, that's her name. In Gen Six, I thought she was kind of nice. I liked her. That and Hugh, Hugh was pretty badass in Gen Five. So Dick was his name. Yes, and we're gonna we're gonna go with that. The red-haired individual. 
That's our police here in the world of Pokemon. I'm going out and arrest this kid, right? Nope, they don't fucking do shit. They don't do shit. They are useless. But anyway. Yeah, alright. Big discovery, yep. Here, you hold the mystery egg, because I don't want it. I don't want it when you give it back to me later, either. Especially then. I don't want all that shit. What? He gave you a Pokedex? Oh my god! Alright, yeah, alright. Yeah. Why don't you take the Pokemon Gym Challenge? I don't know, how, how about you just, like, fucking, you know, not... I still think they need a fucking, like, a tiered system with promotion and relegation for Pokemon trainers. I just still think that'd be fucking cool. I, I would like that. That would be fun. But anyway, um... We're gonna stop right here. If you've made it this far on YouTube, you know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching, and remember, the ghost key is the only place where pants are optional. <laughs>